Today we're going to stay in a Cypress Suite at the Bellagio. When you arrive at the front of the Bellagio, it's easy to see that you're in a special place. After you drive past the fountain, you'll see another fountain, and then another little fountain as you walk in the front. The Bellagio likes fountains. As soon as you walk in, you can't help but to admire the famous glass sculpture. Been up there about 20 years. Wonder how long that glue is gonna hold. We really like how big the casino is. It's uh, spread out, the machines aren't too close together. Uh, for the Cypress Suites, when you get off to the elevator, you'll see a short hallway that leads to a single door. As soon as you walk into the Cypress Suite, you just have to stop and take it all in. It's a really nice living area. There's a dining area with a giant flat screen TV. Seating for four. There's a dresser there with some storage. And I think there's a mini fridge in there. And the marble tiles at the entranceway. We did enjoy a room service at the table. We didn't use the living area much because well, because you can't see the view from the couch. It's an open floor plan with a big bookshelf that separates the bedroom area. There's an amazing view from the bed. The uh, it has automatic curtains. You just push a button and the curtains open. Once we opened them, we never closed them again. We slept with the curtains open. <laughs> and it's hard to fall asleep with a view like that. comfortable pillow top king size bed. Even had a view from my bathroom. There's more marble tile, marble sink recessed dresser with a lot more drawers than what I need. A little bench for sitting in by the window. Nice marble shower. It's a, a steam shower. Mindy turned it on and it didn't take long to get up to what, 95 degrees or something like that. I've never been much for steam saunas. The marble countertop, uh, an 18 inch built in TV into the mirror. You know, I never knew that I wanted a view from my shower until I had a view from my shower. You can watch the fountains go off while you're showering. Yeah, Mindy's bathroom was a mirrored image of mine, except it has a marble surrounded whirlpool bathtub instead of the steam shower. Other than that, they're the same. Although Mindy bragged that her bathroom closet is the one that has the safe in it. <laughs> her bathroom's also the one that had the scale. I don't know who uses a scale while they're on vacation, but they're doing it wrong. I'll tell you from the 15th floor, you can't hear the music that goes with the fountain show. I forget what channel it is, but you can turn the TV to one of the to the right channel to hear the music while you're watching the fountain show out the window. Uh, 
I lost track of how many fountain shows we sat there and watched. I just can't tell you how incredible that view is. This suite comes with 1,500 square feet, four TVs. Of course, in the bathroom, you've got your shower gels and lotions. Comes with a razor and mouthwash. All that stuff that you might have forgotten. It has, uh, has lots of electric outlets and USB ports for all of your electronic toys. And I really appreciate that it comes with high-speed wireless internet. If you've never stayed in a Cypress suite at the Bellagio, we highly recommend you do it at least once.